In the glamorous world of the Kardashians, there's more than meets the eye, especially when it comes to their religiousness. Amidst the headlines about fashion and fame, there's a quieter story about the family's connection to Christianity. Yes, from private Bible chats to public church affirmations, their beliefs shape their daily routines. Kris Jenner, the family's mom, found a church popularly known as the Kardashian Church. Let's delve deeper into the details and find out how mommy Kris got involved in the founding of a church. The Kardashian family has always been open about their Christian faith. From starting their day with a Bible verse to attending church services, all of them are spiritual. Kris Jenner, the matriarch of the Kardashian clan, played a pivotal role in establishing spirituality in her kids. But Chris's journey into church involvement began unexpectedly. She crossed paths with a pastor named Brad who had a challenging past. Pastor Brad had a troubled past and found solace in ministry. Inspired by his story of redemption, Chris decided to support him in his mission to start a church. And together, they laid the foundation for what would become the California Community Church. Chris generously provided financial assistance by covering the rent for the congregation's meeting space and Pastor Brad's salary. However, the media perpetuated it incorrectly. Yes, the church's website clarifies that Chris's role is more supportive than ownership-based. She does not serve on its leadership board and neither does she want to. The church in question is located in Agora Hills, California. It was previously known as Life Change Church. It rebranded under Brad's leadership and following themes of redemption. Chris found this church almost 15 years ago. So you can believe that this is Kardashians and Jenner's go to church. While Chris Jenner's connection to the church may be indirect, her former son in law Wes, is more directly involved. Although Wes is not on the church, he's known for his Sunday service events. These events feature gospel performances by a choir he personally selects. Many celebrities and fans are attracted to this and often visit this church. Candy also brought a property that used to be a church, but this deal didn't go smoothly. Neighbors were against the sale and eventually West abandoned the property. But despite all this, Candy embraces Christianity. The thing's questions have arisen regarding the church's financial practices, including allegations of it being used as a tax write-off. Critics point to the church's tax-exempt status and its alleged ties to the Kardashian-Jenner empire. The topic of membership fees has also stirred controversy. Yes, some reports suggest that the church imposes a hefty monthly fee for attendees. Some say that Chris is using the church for personal gain. While some doubt her motives, others believe Chris Jenner's intentions might be more altruistic than they seem. The debate is on and the answers aren't clear. But despite the misconceptions surrounding the church, one thing is clear. Faith plays a central role in Kardashians and Jenner's life. It also impacts their actions and decisions.